off with the colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are And the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why we stay Alright If you're seeing this video um, Getting ready to go to Abby's appointment with her surgeon but you're gonna see that soon I don't know when because I don't know what the outcome is but as I said yesterday I want to just make sure I'm kind of protecting Abby taking care of her if I need to so we'll see how things go I got this new oh gosh that's really like potent I got this new palette yesterday Say hi, Jace. From ColourPop. So I'm seeing how it works. Don't want anything like too crazy today just to go to the doctor. But, um, nervous for Abby. But you'll have to wait till later to find out. The results of that appointment just gonna bring you on the rest of my day hopefully it doesn't involve just a nap for the rest of the day because I'm pretty tired I'm gonna be completely honest with you did not sleep well last night so we're gonna finish getting ready and I think I have five minutes left until I need to head out I don't want to like go crazy with this palette And I haven't used it before. So, we're gonna finish getting ready and then I'm gonna go. All right, continuing on our day, check this out. Abby these, I put that one in last time. did this. You know that Ashley's going to be upset this is done, right? Yeah. <laughs> now it makes me want to have the Maui one so bad. Should I just order it on Amazon? Yeah. It's like $8 more than the Costco price. But like when, you, when you're making the puzzle and you're finding all the little details, like all the little places and like... like the you, chickens. There's a bunch of chickens. Yeah, there's just chickens all over it and then like the... the duck. There's ducks. A duck. And then the puka dog is my favorite. Um, over here, the little puka dog shack that is in Poipu. No, it's in, yeah. Or in Kapa, no. Where is it at? Kaloa. It's in Kaloa. Also a helicopter. A helicopter. And the Kilauea Lighthouse. And then the Nepali Coast. Which, if we go back to Kauai, we're going to do a boat cruise and see the Nepali Coast. Because we still haven't done that yet. Jason and I tried. Um, but the swells were too big, so we couldn't go up north. So we definitely want to do that. Kauai is going to be a different island when we get to go to it next. Because the we just the kids are older. And dolphins. Yeah, so cute. Yeah, I was going to say, it's been staying blue. We've been making sure that... Does it smell smoky up there? No, I know. I just want to clean the air. Um, are the girls awake? I don't even know if they're awake. I've been on the phone. Um chatting with my dad and my sister. I'm going to call my twin sister. You'll have to stay tuned with the outcome of Abby's appointment today. Um, just bear with us as we deal with the emotions of that appointment. Um, yeah, I have shivers. <laughs> I have shivers. I don't know why. It's not, I am kind of cold. It's not as, as warm of a day as um, it should be at this point in the game. The sun is kind of peeking out, but we also have half smoky sky, sky is still um we're just we're very chill today but i've got to i've got a whole shopping cart of cheerleading classes on my <laughs> computer but i need to add one more through a different website for ashley for the fall her cheerleading is getting expensive <laughs> i will say it's getting expensive all right this day keeps getting more and more interesting <laughs> if kaylee wants to share more of the story um uh, she can. I am just sitting here 
I'm going to eat some lunch. I've got some cottage cheese jello and some blueberries. Um, and then I'm gonna drink some of our juice that we made yesterday. If you ever watched that? We made um, fresh squeezed juice from carrots, um, apples, oranges, and a lemon. Very, very good. Um, so I'm gonna get this in and then I'm gonna make Kaylee some top ramen. She just got home from camping all day early, day and a half early to be fair. Um, both her and Jacob got sick last night, middle of the night, middle of the night. And then that put him, well, I, I won't share that personal information <laughs> about Jacob, but Kaylee was up till about 3 a.m. and then um, sick um, side of their car. Um, luckily they're only, they were very close by. I wish they had reached out to me, but she didn't. She didn't feel like she needed to. But at six in the morning, Jacob decided to go home. <laughs> he was like, I'm not doing this. I'm not being sick out in the woods. So he drove himself home, which he should have called his parent to come get him because they're close enough. He didn't. It's okay. His decision. Um, so he went home to sleep, uh, but it left everyone there without a car and a ride home. <laughs> so once um, Jacob's parents found out what happened, which I told Kaylee, I was like, just because you're an adult doesn't mean you can't call your parents when emergencies like this happened because I literally could have come to get you. So Jacob's dad drove out and picked them all up from their campsite, helped them pack all their gear up and brought them all home. Kaylee got home about, I don't know, half hour ago. Surprised me. I was like, you are not supposed to be home right now. Um, she's feeling a little, uh, I think honestly we have figured out that no one, the three people, three or four people that got sick, they just forgot to eat the day they went camping because they were all busy getting ready to go camping. And then when they got to the campsite, got everything set up, they ate hot dogs and chips and soda. <laughs> so then they all threw up at midnight and one in the morning and two in the morning. And I'm like, yeah, I'm pretty sure that a normal person would get sick after that kind of a diet. So they're all just tired. Kaylee's got her air mattress sitting on the floor here. She ended up bringing home all the food, um, well, all the non-cold food in a rush. She just stuck it in the bag that the, um, what do you call it? air mattress came in. All the food was just shoved into that bag. So she, all the um, two other girls brought most of the food. Um, just they kind of divvied up assignments or whatever. So she's got to take that food back to her friend um, just across the street, Evelyn's house. Um, but she's up in the shower. She's going to have me make her some ramen just to kind of get her stomach <laughs> eating food again. I did make her take a swig of my orange juice. <laughs> she's like, this wasn't as good as you said it was going to be. And I'm like, no, but it'll help you really feel better. Get some extra nutrients in you. But other than that, I have been on the phone like all morning behind the scenes. I've been on the phone with my dad and my sister, my, my twin sister, my battery's flashing. That's going to tell me to go and eat lunch and I'll be back with you. Um, in just a bit. Got you a play date. Can you go brush your hair? No, <laughs> that's not enough. Twit. Can you please go and brush your hair and then we'll get in the car and we'll break is over back to being mom. We're gonna go get two of her girlfriends and bring them back here to play because I figure oh, the sun is out. I guess we can take this jacket off. They're gonna play here for a couple hours and then um, we'll go home, take a break, get dinner, and then meet back up at cheer. And then Ashley gets to have an activity for church. They weren't supposed to have any this summer, but I think they just last minute started planning one tonight. She'll miss the first little bit of it. You know that there's an activity tonight, right? Yeah. Okay. I'm missing the whole thing. No, you'll only miss the first like 20 minutes of it. Why? Okay, we're gonna go, guys. I don't remember what I filmed last. It's a struggle when I'm filming two different days, two different videos. So I went and got Ashley's friends for her play date, brought them back here. Going there, I was like, oh, I'm really tired. My eyes are having a hard time. Put on my sunglasses. It's a fine. I pick up the girls and like each girl that I picked up while well, Ashley went up to the door. I'm like, I'm just going to close my eyes for a second. My eyes are just really like 
So I closed my eyes. I, I could, I was almost passed out in the two minutes it took Ashley to get to the door and get the friend. <laughs> Coming home, I was scared. I was like, I almost need to like pull over and like rest my eyes. And if it had just been Ashley in the car, I might have just done that. I might have just gotten her a slushie and <laughs> said, hey, we need to go sit in the park for a second and let mom rest her eyes. Because I was so tired. I, consecutive sleep didn't happen. So I got very interrupted sleep for three hours from 3 to 6 a.m. I probably woke up every hour, if not every half hour. I could not fall asleep, like get comfortable. So I came home from picking them up and knew that they would all be totally occupied. They obviously have free reign of like any craft project <laughs> they would like, which they did. Um, I think they had a fun time. But I literally just took my bag and I grabbed a drink of water and I went straight up to my room. And I sat there for maybe five minutes and drank some water and had a small snack. And then I laid down. A solid two hours. Like, I gotta wake up. I gotta look at the time. I just need to look at my watch. Just open your eyes to look at the time. Because I need to get Ashley ready for cheer. <laughs> that was a half hour ago. So I have since had dinner myself and, and some more water. And if I wasn't so busy doing all these things I would have gone for a walk because it was probably a good day to go for a walk. Although there's more smoke in the sky. What is all that? I thought there was blue skies. Uh, maybe that's just a regular cloud. But you ready to go Ash? Look like I'm drunk. <laughs> okay we're gonna go take Ashley to cheer practice. Ready? Oh, she's not listening. Maybe she's in the car. All right let's take her to practice. It's really not going to get old watching them practice and cheer. Oh, there's a honey buck in the way. You see all their little purple and black outfits over there? So cute. I've been sitting here in the parking lot filming another video, but also then just wanting to like ride out traffic. I don't have to sit in it. Might as well like be productive. But now I can sit on my phone and look at the internet and a stupid internet connect like there's no even network connection right here so now there's no point in sitting in a parking lot so I'm just gonna hopefully traffic is a little bit better going home but yeah I won't get old watching Ashley um, practice cheer I did just sign her up for her fall squads on her other squad and man, it is, it is getting expensive. I want her to do this, but she hasn't been on the competitive squad before. So I didn't know that prize tag until today. She's only practiced with them a few times as just a kind of a courtesy to see if she wanted to do it. And it was like the last, I think, two or three weeks of the season session last year. Like, well, not last year, like in the spring, I should say. Um, it is, I'm glad only one kid is doing something right now because it's all I can afford. She really loves doing it though. Okay, just because you're the only one who is with me most of the time. How was cheer? Good. Good? Yeah. And then we went to an activity. What did you guys do tonight? Not really. You did crafts? Yeah. And then they played in the backyard a lot, huh? Yeah. They have a good backyard. Are you tired? Yeah. Yeah. You're wanting to go and find puzzles, yeah, though, aren't you? because I finished the whole thing. Well, uh, yeah, we did. You know, you can tear it apart and start no. over. <laughs> this is why I don't do puzzles. Because you feel so accomplished doing yeah. it the first time that you don't want to, like, undo it. It just doesn't feel So, good. tomorrow we will go look at Target yeah. for new puzzles. And maybe Costco. Well, we can try again at Costco. Yeah. yeah. I don't know that they're going to restock them. So. Yeah, I think they will. But we're going to go home and shower, get ready for bed. It's 8.30. Yep. Easy, easy on our tiptoes.